The princess in black was trying not to worry about the nosy duchess. She was busy battling a big blue beast. The monster was just so huge and heavy. It was all tied up, but she couldn't push it back in the hole. Go back in that hole, said the princess in black. Roar, said the big blue monster. Behave, beast, said the princess in black. Roar, said the big blue monster. The princess in black sighed. She raised an eyebrow. Please, she said. The big blue monster sighed too. It rolled into the hole. Duff cheered. The princess in black bowed. Thank you, my friend. Until next time. She patted a goat's head. She sprang onto Blackie's back. They galloped into the forest. She had to get back to Duchess Wig Tower. She hoped she wasn't too late. The big blue monster plopped down into Monsterland. It chewed off the rope. The rope was pretty yummy, but not as yummy as goats. There was a rule not to climb through the hole. Now it remembered why. The sun was too shiny up there. The air was unpleasantly fresh, but that had nothing to do with the rule. Monsters should not climb through the hole because of the princess in black. She would not let them eat goats. The big blue monster was going to remind the other monsters about the rule, but then it found a pile of toenail clippings. Yum, it said, and it forgot all about the princess in black. Duff whistled as he walked his goats home. No goats had been eaten. That meant it had been a good day, all thanks to the princess in black. He wished he could help her, but everyone knows that goat boys do not fight monsters. He thought again about Princess Magnolia possibly being the princess in black. What a clever disguise that would be. No one would suspect a girl in glass slippers, but of course it was a silly idea. If the goats stood up on their hind legs, they would be the same height as Duff just like the princess in black. His goats had honey brown eyes, just like the princess in black. None of them had tiaras though. A goat would also be an excellent disguise for the princess in black. No one would suspect a goat, just as no one would suspect a goat boy. Duff was getting an idea.